Hello everyone, TNG here, back with episode 44 of my Russian Clank 2 playthrough. This is actually going to be my longest Russian Clank playthrough yet, which is interesting. Um, actually, wait, how much was Nexus? I think Nexus was, uh, I think they were both 42, number one and Nexus. I'm, I'm, if I'm not mistaken, I think that's the case. But to be fair, Nexus was pretty short and I think the original game was pretty short as well compared to the rest of, what am I doing? I need to actually equip the damn things before I start buying them. Um, but yeah, to, to be fair, that they were short. I look, Nexus was long enough for me. I enjoyed it. I would have preferred if it was slightly longer, though. Like, it was. It just it needed a little bit more than what it had. But I, whatever, you know. It was still really, really fun. Don't get me wrong. I need to equip the dynamo. Yay! Who loves the dynamo today? Jeez, they're actually using this a fair bit. Surprisingly. Um, wow, the actual the plasma coil actually hit. That's pretty cool. From all that distance away. Not bad, not bad. Um, how much? Yeah, it's, it's going to take forever to level up. I didn't buy any ammunition for it. Uh, at least you can get ammunition from boxes for the plasma coil, which is always a bonus, I guess. Um, well, hello, buddy. What are you trying to do over here? Huh? Huh? Didn't think so. Alright, so we have to make it to the end of the level, which also means doing some super fun parkour. Um, if you recall. Ugh, that was, that was, that was not fun. Um, just, just because of the hitboxes. I don't know if I had that trouble in the original game, but I tell you, it, it was certainly not what you'd expect. Um... Yeah, like, like, honestly, the hitboxes were pretty bad. What am I doing here? What are you do? What are you all? Stop firing your lasers at me! Come on! So rude! Wow! Scumbags! Hey, it's a continue point. Yeah, that's nice. I forgot that, that was the case, actually. Um, if you're all wondering why I'm actually, oh boy, doing the uh, wait, what? Oh, okay. I'm like, this is not the path I'm used to. <laughs> That's nice of them to do that. I that was actually really nice of them to do that. Um, I was gonna say, if you're all wondering why I'm actually doing the entire level, I honestly I don't know. It's just fun playing Russian Clank, so why not just record it? You know, it just seems like something that you should do. And I hate turrets. The fuck? Oh, the turret got rid of my shield. That's so mean. Ah, lame. All right. And there's the end of the level, I guess. So we have to fly up to the top of the tower. Oh, I can see it from here. <laughs> uh, as soon as it, you know, as soon as it says top of the tower, I'm looking at all the towers, and I can see it. It's like it's this one right here, if I'm not mistaken. Pretty easy to do. So we'll grab that real quick. We. All right then. And now we want to make our way over to there again. So we have to fly down here. Um, because from there we can obviously take the taxi back to the ship, which is good. So let's do that, shall we? It was this away. Let's fly, fly. Um, this is actually the original entrance, isn't it? What? Okay, I was gonna say, is there no taxi? <laughs> um, also the okay, so the secondary entrance. I guess you'd never go back to it again. Interesting. Hmm. Oh well, I'm not complaining. Um, now off to the next planet, which I was it the warehouse planet I'm doing next. I can't remember. Or, I can't remember which one it is. I think it's a warehouse planet, or I think it's the... Isn't it the one right before I get captured, actually? Yeah, 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 yeah. It is, too. Okay. Um, I should know how to get one of those platinum bolts. You have to go through the entire level again. It's at the end. Basically, the cutscene where you got caught um, stopped you from getting the platinum bolt, which is kind of annoying. Uh... Like, they're, they're actually saying, you know, you have to do the entire level. Ha 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 we're so smart. Um, but at least it's an easy bolt to find, sort of thing. That's that's how I see it, anyway. Um, so, it's not so bad. We already clicked the one that was on the ship, if I'm not mistaken. So, we don't have to worry about that. Um, yeah, Silver City. We've done that one. Mm, obviously, the spaceship ones. I don't know how I'm going to handle those. I think I might have to do those off camera myself. Just look. I, I mean, I, I'll level with you. I could record it um, over and over and over and over again, right? And then just cut out all the, the failed attempts and put the right the, the the attempt that I got it 
in a video and upload that, but it's just like, eh, I'd just rather just grind it out without, you know, having to record it all and edit it and stuff. It, it just seems easier just to say, haha, look, I got the bolt off camera, you know. Um, so we're going to get to the level regularly, if I'm not mistaken. Obviously going to pop out these guys and uh, get another shield. I want the Zodiac so badly. It's actually not as out of reach as you would think. I mean, I've only got 400,000 bolts, but if you think about it, I'm going to get nearly another 200,000 bolts from, um, what do you call it? The Moonstones. Oh, thank you for the strafing tips. That's uh, it's really helpful. Thanks. Um, no, but I'm going to get about another 200,000 bolts from the Moonstones. Oh, yeah. I need to do the Insomniac Museum as well. I don't care what entrance I do, because they all essentially do the same thing, if I'm not mistaken. But I need to do one. Um, so, I I don't know. I know there's one um, quite literally. I think it's through. No, it's not through there. So it's on the other side of this staircase. No. Is it up here? I think it's up here. Right, there's a taxi over that side of the fountain. I think. I think that's where it is. But you have to have your, your PlayStation time set to like... It's, it's probably like 12 noon in the US or something. But for an Australian, it's, it's like 3 a.m. So obviously, for Australian people, it's, you know... You couldn't do it legit, so you'd actually have to change the time yourself. Which is... It's kind of upsetting considering there is a you know a PAL version of the game. You'd think that they would um go out of their way to uh, set that up so it worked properly for the PAL version as well. But oh well. Um, either way, it, it's still a pretty nifty way of doing it. And there's also one I know that you can get, I believe, from a grind rail on this level. I think from this grind rail. I don't know. It could be from the uh, from another level, but. Um, there's also a third one, and I forget that one entirely. If I'm not mistaken as well, the Insomniac Museum has a bunch of parkour as well at the end. I think. Uh, correct me if I'm wrong. I think it does. This, if I'm not mistaken, um, the second game's... In, is it the second game's Insomniac Museum? I think it was probably one of the best ones that there was, if I'm not mistaken. I don't know. Alright, so where on earth are we going? This is a huge bloody... Ah, uh, okay. No, they... they no, so it's, it's past here. There's a taxi that brings me here. Are you serious? Oh, that sucks. Oh, well, whatever. Who cares? Hey, extra um, killing of things and getting more XP. Let's see here. We're maxed out. we still got our shield and our killinoids out, which is also wonderful. I probably want to buy some armor, like I said, but... I don't know, we'll see. I'm just gonna use uh, rockets to kill everything. Get some XP for them. Um, hopefully we can level them up sometime soon, that'd be good. I mean, these guys used to be so difficult. I used to complain about it all the time, remember? Uh, wait, what? Okay, <laughs> that was really confusing. I killed it. Nice. Alright, um, whoa, nearly walked off to my death. That would have been fun. If I do say so myself, um, a lot of enjoyment to be had. What the hell? Huh. Wait, am I going this way? Yeah, I'm going this way. Okay. I was confused for a second there. I don't like this. Ugh. Really confusing. Alright, so a giant room with a bunch of enemies. I love this room. Not really. Kill you all. Um, okay, that doesn't work as well as I thought it would. Blow everything up. Blow everything up. A bunch of bolts too, which is nice to see. I'll get them in a second, obviously. Um, I'll blow this guy up first. I was gonna use another plasma coil, but it's just like, uh, not worth wasting the ammunition, personally. Um, all right, wow, look at all these bolts. There's not many bolts there at all. Not even a thousand. Wow, that sucks. Oh well, it's still better than nothing, I guess. Can't complain. All right, sit up here. Um, I don't know. I'm not going to record a challenge for me to play through. I just, I don't know. I, I, just, I just feel like that's just going over the same old content again. I know this is too, but you have to watch all the cutscenes again, which obviously I'd skip, but I don't know. 
Let's blow up these guys here. Alright, cool. And I believe... Oh, wow, it's right there. That's so terrible. I can't believe I missed that. Seriously? How do I miss that? That's terrible. You would think, like, you'd be down here, right? And you would think you would, you would, uh, you would look up and you'd be like, there's a platform there. Huh. That's weird. But I never did. That's so weird. Well, whatever. Uh, there's a free platinum bolt. I mean, that's... I like that, that spot. That's a pretty good spot for platinum bolt. I like that. Uh, let's... Actually, let's shoot the coil off towards these guys. And... Oh, he didn't die. Interesting. Alright. Oh, he did die. Wait, he didn't die? He did die. Huh. There was just multiples of them, I guess. Um, I can't seem to lock on with the rockets here. I guess I don't actually have the rock the the rock on. Yeah, the rock on uh, mod. So there's that. I'm surprised my shield hasn't leveled up yet. To be perfectly honest with you, kind of interesting. I guess I'm just not getting much XP because these guys are so weak. Perhaps that must be the case. Huh. Oh, that was really weird. Really disorientating, actually. All right, so we gotta go through. Another walking down the side of a building, and then, then we should be at the end of the level, I believe. I remember I died. Right. No, no, not here. Just after this, on that on that building, and it was just like, it took me all the way back to the start. It was just... That was so mean. Nice. Now I'm taking leveled up. Cool. Here it is here. This is where I died. <laughs> so bad. Worst spot to die. Alright. And that was probably my own fault for not having armor. I mean, I don't think I've bought a single piece of armor yet. Which is, yeah, I mean, definitely my own fault, but still. Oh, okay, here it is. I was going to say, where's the way through? I don't understand. Alright, hop down here. Oh, the, um, Fizz Wizard Robot's still there. Fizz Wizard Robot? Fizz Wizard Robot. Okay, sounds good. Can't actually do anything. Okay. Where's the swing shot target? Uh, there must be one here somewhere. There it is. Can I even reach that from here? I mean, really? Can I? Wow, that's crazy. You can reach it from that distance. Oh well, whatever. Alright, got that platinum bolt. You can see that one from the ship, obviously. Now the question is, is there a quick way off this area or not? Because I don't think there is a... Oh, oh there is. Oh, this guy's got his guy's... I have to walk all the way back through the level? Are you serious? No! No! How dare you! Um, Alright, so... It's pointless buying ammunition here because I'm just gonna have to buy some more after using the killer notes and stuff on the next level anyway so might as well just do that when I get there now I believe it's either the warehouse planet or the planet with all the Furbies uh, oh it's this one because we've done that one obviously not gonna do that one yet um, all right this one I I believe I actually um I seen how to get it, and I was just like, oh, well, that leads back to the start of the level. I'm not going to do that. <laughs> That's the worst part about it. Um, this one's pretty easy to get. It's uh, it's at the start of the massively long bridge with all the tanks on it. So we'll go do that. I know I could probably get the Ninotech thing on this level. Return to the bridge. Oh, cool. Sweet. Um, but I just can't be bothered. Uh, yeah, see. That's weird. I wonder why... No, I, 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 I'm I, pretty sure I've seen that, but for whatever reason I said I'd do it later or something? I must have said that. I'm pretty sure I've seen that. That's weird. I can't believe I... Wow. Okay. Interesting. Well, look at this. The They're getting closer to level up, so what I'm going to do is just fire this off. Let's go ham on, on the tanks. With the... Wow. That's a lot of damage that they're dealing right now. I just want to get that XP. I really do. Um, nice. Cool. So everything is almost dead. Everything is dead. Alright, sweet. That was uh, pretty worthwhile. Spending all that ammunition. I, I guess I got some XP, didn't I? Looks like I did. It's pretty close to leveling up, which is always what I want to say. Alright. Let's buy some more of everything. Because I can. 
I don't need to. I, I don't need to wear the kilonoids at all. Ah, oh, well. Now, how do we start this? Do we have to glide down to there? Looks like I do, yeah. Okay, that's pretty easy. This looks relatively simple. Um, but I could be mistaken, obviously. I do like that it changed the camera angle for me. Actually, you know what, though? We're going to wrap this episode up here. So, thank you so much for watching episode 44 on my Ratchet Collect 2 playthrough. Hope you enjoyed watching. And have a good day. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like and post a comment below to tell me how I can improve. And feel free to subscribe for more. Thanks for watching. I mean, I'm expecting something so difficult and I'm just ignoring the obvious. That's so bad.